Hello everyone, my name is Team Wing, and in this video, I will show you 5 tips to make your Android device faster. Live wallpapers are pretty and cool, but it can have a big impact on the performance of your Android device. By using static wallpapers, your device will use less RAM and processing power, which in turn help your Android device operate smoother. One of the best features of Android is the ability to use widgets, as it helps display more information on screen. However, having many widgets on screen is like filling your desktop with icons. By doing so, your device will take longer time to boot up and require more RAM and processing power. The other benefit of having less widgets on screen is that you can showcase your favorite wallpapers. Most Android devices come with bloatware. My Samsung Tab S2 comes with applications that I do not use, such as CNN for Samsung, Memo, and Samsung Plus. You can disable or remove those applications by going to Settings, Choose Applications, Select Application Managers, pick the application that you do not need and uninstall it. If that option is not available, then disable the applications. But remember to clear cache and data first, as they are still reside in Android. I love animations. Seeing the application menu transition to the screen once you click it is quite satisfying. However, is it necessary? If you do not think so, then you can turn off animations by going to Settings, select About Device, locate Build Number, and click on it 7 times to enable Developer Options. Once inside Developer Options, turn off animations for Windows, Animation Scale, Transition Animation Scale, and Animator Duration Scale. Then restart your device. The great part about this is that you can always go back to enable it. Samsung devices comes with TouchWiz Launcher. It is the interface that sits on your Android OS. TouchWiz has come a long way and Samsung has refined the launcher a considerable amount. However, it is still a memory hog. Since Android OS is flexible, you can change your launcher. I choose Google Now Launcher as it is quick and to the point. You can choose different launchers such as Nova or Apex Launcher. Here is a sneak peek of my new Samsung Tab S2. I will be doing more videos about this tablet soon. Again, my name is Team Wing. If you like my video, don't forget to give me a like and subscribe.